Success is not accidental, but failure can be accidental. You cannot pass an exam accidentally. Getting an A+, in a course or subject can only be deliberate. No matter the level you find yourself, this video is for you. Whether you are in the elementary, primary, high school or the university. My experience in teaching has exposed me to what successful students do to continually get ease and what unsuccessful students do to not get ease. I am going to introduce you to what to do to deliberately get ease at the end of every semester. After watching this video and taking action, you will know if you are going to get A in any exam you are going to take. What comes to mind now is, is it possible to finish learning everything before the exam? Later in this video, I'm going to show you how to learn everything in the course outline without stress. I'll start by saying this. Know the content of the whole course or subject you are going to be studying. It could be an exam for a semester or an exam which you prepare for over a year or more. Knowing the content of the course or subject will help you know where you are heading towards. Before the construction of the building or edifice, the plan of the building is drawn. Otherwise, the builders will not have anything to do. You will have in mind the kind of challenge you have to overcome. If you have no idea about the content of your course or subject, you will welcome any grade. Knowing the content will make you act or approach the course or subject differently from those who do not know the content. Since you have an overview of what you are going to be tested on, you can be assured of getting your A+. The only issue with knowing all the content is that it will make you stressed up if you have a few months or years to complete it. You are going to perceive it as impossible, but there is a way out. And here is how. Make a plan, like a timetable, to finish learning everything a month or two before the exams. I'm aware of the fact that not everything you study is going to drop in the exam. The advantage of studying almost everything is to boost your confidence. I'm a firm believer in what you see is what you get. With your confidence at the peak, you can be able to brainstorm and come up with the best answers. When the questions require some thinking, you will not fall short. The downside of not studying most of what your course entails is that you will have low confidence. You are already convinced you are not ready, so your brain neurons are not ready to fire up or put you over and above the questions you are going to meet. Making plans to finish studying the whole content requires sacrifice and discipline. A very strict one, if all you can see is A+. Affirmation without discipline is the beginning of delusion. You need to embrace certain actions and let go of other ones based on the results you have made up your mind to achieve. Make a plan and stick to the plan, no matter the drawbacks or challenges. If your preparation or plans towards finishing your syllabus is not effortful, the truth is, you will not be doing it right. You are in your comfort zone. A plus is not at the comfort zone of the alphabet. It is found at the peak of all the alphabets. A plus is not comfort zoned, so you won't find it there. Your plan should be strict enough to help you finish studying before the exam. You should have weeks ahead of you to do revision before the exams. Devote hours, minutes, and seconds to studying something new each and every single day so that the plan to finish weeks before the exams will be achieved. Now some specific actions to take in order to complete the syllabus. So the first one is this. You have to intentionally ignore your friends and social media. This will help you to focus. Two. Ask for help from your tutors and colleagues on topics which look challenging. Now the third point, solve past questions after completing every particular topic. Taking these actions will put you on a pedestal to get your A+. Thank you for watching this video. This is Seprint. If you found this video very helpful, I will urge you to subscribe, hit the like button and then comment on what you are going to do in order to get your A plus in the upcoming exam you have to write.
Thank you for watching and keep studying by yourself.